Hey. Hey, everybody. We're coming live from Columbiana, Alabama. From the back of our yard. Yes, from our backyard. Let's see who comes on. Oh, we got somebody. We got one person. Hey. Hey, friends. As you come on, remember to hit those likes and the, the hearts. hearts. Just to let people know. Hi, Norma. Hello, hello. It is kind of early. This is a little bit early for us, isn't it? It is. It is absolutely. Hi, Patricia. Hey, Patricia. Chinchar. That's a fun name. Patricia Chinchar. Hi, Sharon. Sharon. Sharon is a regular. It's hey, good everybody. To have you here. We're just going to let some. Let Facebook bring you guys on. We talk about that all the time. It takes a minute for Facebook to know we're live. And as you guys come on and you hit the hearts and the likes, it kind of gets things moving. So thank you. Um, Hi, Joyce. How are you? Hey, Joyce. Janice. Christine. Hi, Sharla. Louise, Fountain. that's a okay. fun name. Hey, Della. Hey, Ray. There's Barbara. Barbara Smith from Arkansas. Pocahontas, Arkansas. Pocahontas. Robin's from Kentucky. Robin. Hey, everybody. How are you? Thank you, Deborah. Hey, Deborah. Deborah's saying happy anniversary. Thank you, Deborah. All Debra. the way from Arizona. Thank you so much. We're spending our anniversary with y'all tonight. Yes. <laughs> hey, Deb from Florida and Jimmy and Regina Wilson and Marilyn from South Alabama. Jody is Jody. from Murfreesboro, mm -hmm. Tennessee. Murfreesboro. Been there on business a few times. Yeah. So we didn't, we weren't on last night. Um, so we thought we'd pop on tonight show you a few things around the house that uh, have been taking place yeah show you guys what's going on so i'm gonna switch our our mics are at the uh at the office so we're gonna stay on this side of the camera and not not wander off although i do have a temptation to wander off from time to time mm -hmm. so look what uh clint has done he has cleaned it completely off and he has started building on this back side. Um, he came just this afternoon. What time did he get here this afternoon? Um, he got here. Actually, he was here about lunchtime. Lunchtime? Yep. Okay. He had a little work to do at someone else's place today. Oh, okay. But he's taken, hold on. He's taken all the trim off the door. Oh, okay. You can I see, see all that. Yeah. And then. Um, you know, there's so much that has to be done before you actually even start all this, right? Yeah. So. Oh, between the blocks, he poured um, concrete um, down. No, I don't know if it was every single one. Was it every single one? Uh, if you they or just the ones that were going to get the bolt, get the anchors. You well, see the bolt right there? Yeah, in the video that he sent us, it was like every single one of them. Oh, okay. Had. But these are J-bolts. J-bolts, and he put those in, and he had to let them um, dry for, gosh, close to a day, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. And then he's, he's got, it came in today, probably this afternoon, probably the first thing he did was tighten those down. This... Uh, Really wish I knew what that board was called, but you know. And now he's got these half of this. Well, this whole side's done, and ready. Yep. For it's all level. Everything's level. <laughs> he's got his leveler right there. So it's nice, mm -hmm. nice, nice, nice. Put in all that support back there. Yeah. That's what he'll anchor these, these uh, joists on. Mm -hmm. He's got that covered up there, the well. So you want to 
What else would you like to show them back here? That is real. Yeah, I mean, this is temporary. Sure. The well it is. right here. It is. It's very temporary. Yeah, we'll yeah. be putting a nice top on that yeah. for sure. So, and then right here, this thing was, we had filled it up a little too high. So, we worked really hard to get we'll put the it over extra here. over here. And I didn't tell you, but Bubba, who, who owns the, the trailer, he's going to be here probably tomorrow morning around 6.30 to pick it up. Awesome. So. Okay. And then this is all of Daryl's, all this old wood. All the old wood. The old, old wood. Get to build some things out of that. Yeah. What size beams yeah. would those be? What would they call this? Like so these were... We, this. It's, it's probably a, a true two by six, two by six, which today's two by six is not true. Is that what uh, that's over there? Uh, over there on the back side. Is this a two by six? Yeah. Yeah. This is, this is today's two by six. Mm -hmm. And that is probably whenever that was um, cut and lumbered is a true two by six. Yeah. So. It looks awesome. Yeah. Good stuff. Decking, columns, so he's, you know, this is, when he's ready, the, the just below those two, or yeah, those two by sixes, that's decking down there, all those yellow tags. Mm -hmm. We'll cover the, uh, these awesome beams. Oh uh, yeah, beautiful beams. Mm -hmm. Looks so good. So we're, we're getting excited about our back porch being done. So, mm, it's going to be great. It will be. So good. Do you want to uh, show them what you did on the front? Uh, sure. Yeah. yeah. There you go. All right, y'all. Let's go to the front. I felt a little... Um, I got a little bit of the holiday bug in me today, and I reached out to my cute friend, Kelly, at Main Street Florist and we've been friends forever and I taught all of her kids and I got to see Catherine who's this grown-up biologist she's just the cutest thing so anyway I went to Kelly's shop and I said will you make me some Halloween bows so I've started my a little bit of decorating and so she made me this fun little holiday sparkly bow that I love and who doesn't love mums right mums and pumpkins so I just put some mums and pumpkins on our front porch and so that's what I did and then in the south we do we put bows on mailboxes. So, do you guys put mails on mail bows on mailboxes? One of the things, like when a baby girl is born, they put a pink bow. When a baby boy is born, they put a blue bow. Um, anybody getting married, there's a white bow on a mailbox. So, I had Kelly make me also and you guys if you were with if you've been with me for a little bit we have gone i've taken you guys into her shop and she showed us last year how to make i gotta paint this thing right here i actually have the paint for that she showed us um all of us how to make a christmas bow so have we checked the mail today i haven't checked the mail no. today no mail nothing's in there no, okay so anyway, do you guys remember when I went into Kelly's floor shop and she taught us last Christmas how to make a Christmas bow? She's so sweet. So Kelly grew up here in Columbiana and there's two Main Street florists, one here in Columbiana. Kelly has the shop in Mount Laurel. So anybody who's around here, go see Susan at Main Street florist in Columbiana or Kelly in Mount Laurel beautiful fun shops so 
All right. We decided we have been getting a couple of gifts. Well, we've gotten several and we have not opened them. So we thought that we would open them with you guys tonight. You want to help me figure this out on the selfie stick, D? Um, oh, look at there. Okay. And then this. Can, do we need to lift that up at all? There we go. Probably bring it down a little bit. Okay. Uh, I don't know. That looks pretty good. That looks pretty good? Yeah. Okay. And you've got mm. your... You've got your yeah. pocket knife? All right. So we're going to open a couple of things. This is from Jane Rudder from Alabama. And we've had this little envelope for a minute. So if you... So Jane, if you're on here and you've wondered about it, sometimes when things are sent to the office, it takes us a day or two to to get it. What's going on here? So let's. Jane put some good tape on this. She put some really good tape. It feels kind of like. Let's a... see. Michael said, "Just hopping on. Good evening and happy anniversary. Thanks, you guys." Louise wants, to, Louise wants to know if the table is finished. We need to update the table situation. Do you want to tell them what you discovered last night? Yeah. This is so funny, you guys. So. I don't think they can see the, you. There, there's an, an adage in, in uh, woodworking. Uh, measure twice. Oh, it looks like a cookbook she returned. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. Looks like Mama Sue's. Okay. Okay. Okay, so. Tell them, finish your story about the... Measure twice, cut once. Well, I put those legs, temporarily just set them on that table. And last night when I walked by them, I'm like, those legs look a little high. <laughs> Went to the table that was already there. Okay, that's where it should be. I walked over there and those legs are right here. Okay, this could four or five inches that need to be cut off. And we got in touch with a good friend of ours here um, in Columbiana that has a wonderful woodworking shop. Kenneth, we're going to take you guys to go see Kenneth and Brenda sometime when we get their permission to see their workshop. So you're going back to Kenneth's in the morning. Right. So the legs, you guys, long story short, they were just, they're like, what, this much too big? Um, yeah, that or maybe just a little bit more. Oh. Yeah, Even maybe just, a little bit more. Uh, I didn't do a good job with the measuring. Maybe you were thinking uh, in your brain something about. Well, I cut the boards right in half, right down the middle. So. Okay. I was thinking that. So. Okay. So yes. Oh, dear Miss Annie, I'm returning this cookbook back because I already received one. Oh my goodness, you little sweet girl. All right. So Jane is returning one because she had already gotten one. Oh. So this who is, is this from? What is this? This is from. Brenda. So Brenda Campbell. Um, oh, you and me, we got this with our names oh, on how it. Is that? Isn't that so sweet? Oh my goodness. Brenda, that is so sweet from Tennessee. And here's another one, a different size. And a note and a card. So. <sighs> sweet is Look, this? Our names are on it and everything. That's Brenda, thank you very, very much. That's very sweet. That is the sweetest thing. I love it. That is so sweet. And this was the card that went with it right here. Mm -hmm. Well, Brenda, thank you very, very much. It's hard to believe that we've been these married 40 years. Or the hangers that go with that. Oh, and these are the little hangers. Yeah. Thank you, Brenda. Yeah. Thank you so much. Um, and it's just a housewarming gift. So sweet. All right. And I'll read this card later on. Thank you so much. That is wonderful. And Brenda, you have beautiful handwriting. Yes, she does. Beautiful handwriting. I'm not the best at handwriting. I'd love, I'd like to be, but it's easier for me to print. Lots of happy anniversaries. Thanks, you guys. Thank you so much. Okay, what is this? Hello. Okay, this is from. It I doesn't. Think it's just the manufacturer. Okay. 
you're gonna have to pull that out. You hold on to the box. Okay, I'll hold on to the box. Is there a note inside? There's this. Okay. Yep, right there it looks like. Okay, this is from Paige, from Paige P. I hope you enjoy your new doormat for your new home. I have enjoyed watching y'all remodel your new home. Oh my goodness. Oh Paige. my goodness, with our name on it. What? You guys look at that. How cool is that, Daryl? That is neat. I like it. Listen, I love anything with an initial on it too. Yeah. That M is so great. I love this. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That is so great. This box right here is actually a box of our cookbooks that Daryl has to sign. I've done my part. <laughs> I've done my part, but the office needs more, like they've run out of books and they need these books. So Daryl's gotta sign these. So we're gonna move that over. Wow, thank you so much again, Paige. That is so sweet. All right, oh. what else? You wanna stand in front here so they can it has, see? It's got a little chair thing there. You don't need a knife. Okay. So there you go. And this is from, um, we'll see. I think, there, yeah, I think, I think there's so. gonna be a note in here. Yeah. Let's see. Okay, this is from, let's see. Lots of little, okay. Miss Annie and Daryl, just a little something for your beautiful kitchen. Love following you from Becky Sant Santiago, Santiago in Georgia. Thank you, Becky. Aww. Four pack kitchen dish towels. Listen, and I love these kind because I can tell that they're really gonna absorb well. And then this artificial vanilla sugar. Okay, oh, cool. I can't wait to try that. Yes. That's pretty cool. Thank you, <clears throat> thank you, thank you. This kind of feels like, you know, when you get married, yeah. right? And you get all these little fun presents. Y'all, that is so sweet. Okay, we've got these other things too. Thank you. Okay, what is that one? Cindy Harville from Illinois. Cindy Harville from Illinois. Okay, Deb says, um, oh, it went by too fast. Do you need to get over Deb, here? I think Deb said that it, they would have been married 40 years. My husband and I would have celebrated 40 years on July 1st. He's the lucky one and got to spend it with Jesus. Mm -hmm. Oh, Deb, lots of hugs and prayers for you, sweet friend. Oh, my goodness. Mary McKay, did you find your baking soda today? I honestly haven't looked. Once I got my bread made, then I went to eat lunch with Piper today. And anyway, I've been busy. But I, I haven't even told Daryl that story, and I don't think he's... Did you watch the video today of what happened at Piggly Wiggly? Yes, I did. I had an opportunity at lunch to, to watch that. It was so Very sweet. Do sweet. you remember those days when we were, we were so poor? I could relate <laughs> so, so much. I was like, that oh, is us. Oh, no. and that's sweet, Daddy. Oh, my goodness. Okay. All right, I have seen these, and I have wondered how they worked. I don't know if Daryl knows how these work. They're magnetic. Oh, cool. Oh. Look at this, you guys. Have you guys seen these? I don't know that I've ever seen so they, those. So they're magnetic, and, you and have they a... pop together. You have two sides. Yep, there's nice. two sides, and there's a little leveler. Look at that little tiny one, one sixteenth. That's itty bitty. <laughs> this is really neat. That is. That That's is cool. really neat. Let's see what else. And I think we have the measuring cups that go with it. Oh, are they? Oh. These are fun. I love these yes. colors. The colors of them. Thank you. Thank you. That is awesome. I love them. That is great. And who is this from? Well, I was just looking for the paper. Yeah, don't throw that away. This is from Cindy. This is from Cindy. We'll, we'll keep Yeah, this. save that. Okay, thank you, Cindy. So sweet. And then we've got, okay, 
So the ladies at the office told me, can you bring that box over here before you start cutting it? Okay. So this, okay. So there's a little sticker right here. This was one of our stickers. Please use stool and step when climbing. <laughs> Don't use a chair. Don't use a basically. chair. Basically, I think I know what's in yeah. here. <laughs> no way. You think that's what I it is? I think I might know what's in here. Oh, me is that? Oh, my gosh. So, yes, I was trying to open up the new window, and I was, I got out of chair, and then I fell out of the chair. So, I think somebody I think heard me talk about that. really good glue on this. We got some, okay, we got it. This is from, do we know who this is from? Um, I, I don't know, I don't think so. I think Kate, right from Wait, the Wait, Margie, from Margie Borky? Is that what you're reading? Margie, Margie oh, Borky. Oh, okay. I think I'm saying that. Um, Gerda said would love the link for the measuring spoons and cups if anyone has it, please. Okay. Yes. That would be really cool. So if anybody knows what the link is to that or we can find it and link it. Um, okay. I know what I'll be doing this evening. Does this have to be put together? Yeah. Okay. Oh. be too hard to put no together. i don't think i don't think it will be it has instructions so i've i've been always always been good at following instructions and the bolts are in there okay they're in there oh that's cool that's what it's gonna look like oh that's nice so it says it's a retro stool i remember this i was gonna say that reminds me of <laughs> the 60s do you remember that yes i do i do too oh my gosh okay so this, this is, is perfect. So, How sweet. So Thank great. You. Thank you so much. Yes, you are going to be, you will be putting, oh, and it's a little soft, squishy seat. Yeah, yeah the, the top one. Is. I love it. Yeah. And I'm telling you, so Piper came over, excuse me, I've got sweat going. Piper and Luke came over, I guess what? Labor Day. It's been a couple weeks ago since they've been able to come over, but they were going through the cabinets looking at where we had put everything, right? And then everything was so high, and that's one of the things they said is, Grammy, how are you ever going to reach that stuff? <laughs> so now we have a stool. So this is awesome. This is really awesome. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Thank you guys so much. You guys are so generous, so generous to us. We blows us away. We are just simply humbled by this. Truly. Like, and, it, and it's so funny that today's our anniversary because here we are opening up his presents and, um, yeah, it feels like the day that we got married. We yeah. had all these presents. So anyway, so sweet. Um, we just love you guys. Can you guys hear us okay? I, I think as long as we stay on this side. I think we're all I right. I think you're we're, okay. You have all the cars and stuff behind us, but I think we're yeah. okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, Susan said, happy anniversary, my daughters and son-in-law anniversary today. Also, I love what you bring to all of us through your, let's see, what did you say? Through your videos. Well, that is such a sweet comment, really. Um, you guys are the best, Vicki Andrews says. Um, Thank you, Vicki. And Connie said her grandmother has a stool like that, and I can see her now sitting on it and calling in her grocery order to be delivered. <laughs> really? That's kind of neat. Um, and she said she wished that she had gotten it. Um, Carolyn said it is like wedding gifts. It really is. So sweet. So what we're going to do tomorrow is um, we're not doing anything tonight for our anniversary because tomorrow we are cutting the grass tomorrow you are yeah i'm gonna cut oh. the grass okay i'm getting the legs cut for the table we'll cut the grass tomorrow do some general cleanup mm -hmm. and then we're leaving around lunch are we leaving after lunch tomorrow yeah. mm -hmm. and we're gonna head to the beach for two nights we honeymooned in seagrove 
We spent two nights in Stone Mountain, Georgia, and then two nights in Seagrove, which Seagrove is really fancy now, but 40 years ago it was not fancy. Yeah. And That was a place that we would as kids go on a Friday night. Yeah. And so it's near, so Seagrove is kind of near Seaside and it's near Destin. And so um, we just thought we'd go down there and just enjoy the beach for a couple of nights and uh, head on back. So that's what we're going to do tomorrow. Jo said she would love the link for the stool. We will see what we can do with all these things. Um, I think it was off of Amazon, wasn't it? It's a Costco. Oh, Costco. Stool. And it is, I'll show you the box. See the box? It's probably backwards for you guys too, isn't it? So it's Style Air Classic Collection Retro Counter Chair. So there you go. So, all right. So we will, I don't know that we'll do any lives or anything from the beach, but we might take a couple of pictures and send those to you. I know some of you guys have been making comments about um, about the picture, our wedding picture today. Oh. And um, yes. one of the local news guys, Rick Carley, he just retired, but he spent like 43 years in television. He texted me today and he was like, he was talking about what's with the white. And what he was talking about is Rick wore a white tuxedo at his wedding. You wore all white at your at our wedding. So I think that the white part of the tuxedos was a big thing in the 80s. So anyway, it was so sweet because he did a little feature. If you're not following Rick Carley, good news, you guys, he writes the best stories from all over. So it doesn't matter if you live in Washington or if you live in Canada, around the world. He has followers from all over the world and he writes the best stories. And so if you just say, that's why it's called Rick Carley, K-A-R-L-E, uh, Rick Carley, good news. It's all this wonderful, heartfelt, just good news. So anyway, if you're not following him, go follow him. He did a beautiful post. Did you know that today about us? Uh, yeah, I think, I, did you share it on our side or we maybe kind of we, somehow I saw it. Yes. Yes. So it is there ish cause we posted some pictures, but because of Facebook, you have to be careful about what you share. But anyway, so, um, anyway, that was a fun time. It was, uh, that was a sweet day. Our wedding day it was very, a sweet, sweet day. Um, Carla said her husband wore all white also in 1985. Yes. Uh, Paula asked what happened with the porch today. There were just, so go back and watch the live because we went over it at the beginning. So uh, parts of the flooring, floor joists, floor joists were added today. Were added. Yeah. Colette said, love Rick's story on your anniversary today. Wasn't that so sweet? He's just so sweet. Elaine said that she does follow him and loves reading his stories. He writes the best stories. Deborah said her husband wore all white in 1973. 73. Okay. Well, maybe it was a 70s and 80s thing. That's so fun. Kay said, happy 40th anniversary. Thank you. And you love that wedding picture. Um, so, so, um, so sweet of you guys. All right, so Deb Kohler says the stool is on Amazon and so are the measuring spoons and cups. So we'll put a link on also, so we'll try to get the links and put them on our Miss Annie's Home and Kitchen page if at any point you guys wanna just go through there or you can go look Amazon yourself. Um, is there anything else you wanna add? No, I think that's it. No? Mm -hmm. um, Y'all are just the best. We love you. We appreciate you guys so much. Um, Brenda Kay said two cuties then and now. Mm. Thank you. You're, you're very kind. <laughs> Liesl said my husband wore all white in 1981. Wow. And Linda said hers wore all white in 1982. My goodness. I love it. I love it. So much fun. Okay, you guys, we are going to sign off tonight. We sure appreciate you. And 
we're just going to remind you to be stronger every day. Know that you guys can do hard things and we will see you guys next time. Bye cute friends. Good Love night. you.